Okay, I have this weird worldview or perspective that says that everything is influence, or I suppose you could say persuasion. And I don't mean that in a negative way, like taking advantage of people or anything like that. Instead, what I mean is that everything influences and persuades everything else in one way or another. And as marketers and creative types and online business owners, we care about this stuff because influence and persuasion is at the core of what we do. Let me give you an example here. Have you ever been treated poorly at a store by customer service? Of course, we all have, right? That's bad persuasion, isn't it? It leaves a kind of a negative feeling, sometimes a big negative feeling. And we associate that feeling not to the person who treated us poorly, but to the store, to the brand. And this bad persuasion has influenced folks like you and I to never buy from this company or from this business ever again, right? Now, the opposite is true as well, of course, too, right? Where the store owner or the customer service agent treated you beyond well, and they went above and beyond the call of duty and totally took care of your every need, right? And again, this creates a positive association or a positive feeling towards that company and towards that brand. Sadly, this doesn't happen as often as it should, but when it does, that's good persuasion. So persuasion, good or bad, influences our decision making. And the same holds true for your customers and your target audience and the sorts of people that you want to serve through your online business, your venture, or whatever the heck it is that you're doing. And so in my mind, there are only two kinds of persuasion positive persuasion or good persuasion, and negative persuasion or bad persuasion. And if you really stop and think about it, everything, and I literally mean everything, is either good persuasion or bad persuasion. And this totally relates to another concept I've come across, which is how your attitude, your personality, acts as a contagion towards others. This is called the emotional contagion. Okay, Wikipedia describes emotional contagion is as follows. Emotional contagion is the phenomenon, phen phenomenon of having one person's emotions and related behaviors directly trigger similar emotions and behaviors in other people, hence contagion. Synchronization of one's expressions, vocalizations, postures, and movements with those of another person. So emotional contagion means that whatever emotions we're feeling gets spread, almost kind of like a virus, positive or negative, to those near us. Scientists have found most laughter, for example, isn't a direct result of something being funny or humorous, but instead it's a result of laughter of others. So we see someone laughing and we start laughing because they're laughing. We're laughing at the laughter. Okay, so how does any of this relate to our online business and our marketing and all the stuff that we're doing? Well, when people think of us, when they think of our business, when they think of our brands and our products and our services, we want them to be influenced positively, not negatively, correct? And so if that's the case, then we need to be very aware in everything that we do to ensure that we're intentionally creating a positive experience, a positive environment, creating positive persuasion from our branding and our messaging to even the way that we use our voice when we answer the phone or when you're making dorky, stupid videos for the internet. Okay, now, my friend, if you are enjoying this kind of content, then it certainly doesn't end here. Let's go even further. Let's go even more in-depth with all of these ideas. What you need to do is head over to 10tononline.com forward slash traffic. That's where you'll find your free audience attraction bootcamp, which has been carefully set up to give you clear insights and key info to help you bring floods of traffic into your website, into your product pages, and into your offers. It's totally self-paced. I know you're going to love it. It runs about an hour or so. I look forward to seeing you there.